Hello everyone, welcome back to Stalker. Alright, the great saga of the tool hunt is finally behind me. <sighs> now, I'm about to start on the road to Pripyat, but before that I want to tie up some more loose ends, some stashes, and a few other things. But I'm going to do it really quickly, so I'm just going to cut in between. But the first thing to do is try to get some guards for the scientist's bunker. I believe what someone said is that now that I've earned the trust of freedom, they will be willing to do it. So I just need to remember where freedom actually is. Are you freedom? I think you're freedom. Yeah, you're freedom, aren't you? You're also phased inside of a chair, but other than that, you are freedom, right? Yeah, here we go. It depends on the job. Uh, wonderful. Done. Alright, let's go talk to the scientists. For my reward. Okay, what are you gonna give me? Better be something good. Ooh. That's a meat chunk, isn't it? I guess it'd have to be, because it, well, looks like a meat chunk. Okay, which one's Herman? You Herman? No, you're not Herman. You're Herman. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Whoa. The money is not very good, but those are some nice drugs. Ten tablets of side block. I'm probably never going to need that much, but still, it's good to have. Antidote. What is the antidote for? And radioprotectant. Excellent. Antidote. Antidote. Which one is the antidote? Antidote to what? God, that is so good. I've got so much of it, too. Oh, there we go. Toxicity, okay. Well, my toxicity protection with this suit is actually really good. It's the thermal radiation that I really need protection from. But still, good to have. Okay, what's the next, next thing to do? Alright, I'm gonna hit up... What the hell? Let's go have a look at what's happening outside. Hey guys, what's going on? Oh. Apparently nothing. Right here, anyway. Hi. What are you shooting at? Doggies. We'll have fun with that. So, next thing to check out is... Uh, I think the stash. Yeah, I'm gonna hit up the stash. Well, the stash should be in this car right up here, I think. Yeah. I think those are bandits, though. Crouched around it. Oh, and it started raining. Cool. Okay, well, I'm gonna switch to two-shot armor-piercing. They look like bandits. Two of them are wearing overcoats. I'm just waiting for them to react. Come on. Oh, yeah. I thought he threw a grenade, you bastard. Okay. Now, I don't want to make the same mistake I made before many, many times. Which is to loot the bodies before looking around. So let's hold on for a second. It's a body of some sort over there, I think. That or it's a rock. Could be either. Was that thunder or was it the son of a bloodsucker? Hmm. Alright, well, it looks safe. Bed bug. <laughs> oh, I love their names so much. Dog meat. Mmm. Eh, 
Eh, don't care about shotgun rounds. I think I just looted it. Yeah, so, um, somebody posted the code needed for the mutant fix, which was... Like, there was a thread of a bunch of fixes for this game, and that was the only fix I didn't install, because the way you downloaded the fix was kind of weird, and I didn't like it. But thankfully, somebody posted the raw code that I needed to put into the script to fix the mutant looting crash problem. And I've put it in, and it seems to work. What it seems to do, I'm assuming this is intended, is it seems like it doesn't pop up with that UI screen where it shows you all the loot that you're going to get, and then you press OK. So instead, you just press, you just press F on the enemy or whatever the use key is, and then it just automatically gives you all the stuff in your inventory. So I'm pretty sure I just looted it, but I just didn't actually see what it was. Yeah, I probably got a boar chop or two. Mm-hmm. So it seems to be working, which is very nice. Now I can loot with confidence. <laughs> Lure 300 mole. Actually. Hmm. It's a decent scope. That was fun. Goodbye. Ooh, I need to repair my weapon. Is it below 90%? No, 92. Okay. Okay. I feel like I forgot to loot one of the bodies. Eh, oh well. Should be a stash in here. Here we go. Deck of cards, hexagon wood stove, and a marijuana. Okay, I don't suppose I have any fuel for this thing, do I? It's low tier. No, I need charcoal. Because I actually could cook up some of this meat. I have an idea for the meat. Which I guess I'll talk about later at some point, maybe? If I remember, I might forget. Anyway, uh, next stash. Oh yeah, so there's a stash up here, I'm gonna hit that in just a second. But there's actually something in the Jupiter plant I need to do. So I'm gonna head over there and I'll be right back. Well, that's one way to deal with two chimeras. Wow. Bug their path pathfinding and throw a... What was that? A thermite grenade on their face? That is one powerful grenade. Okay. So yeah, the chimeras respawned as well as a bunch of other stuff. I got most of it out, but that thing was amusing enough that I think I'm going to leave it in. That thing. I mean, that encounter with the chimeras. In the meantime, there's some... Uh, particularly creepy and somewhat invisible zombies. Some of, them are, some of them are invisible, like that one, and others aren't. I don't know why. This is, I think this is actually the first time I've ever seen them, though, and they're extremely creepy. They're not very dangerous, but they're creepy as hell. You know what, I'm just going to ignore them. There's no reason to waste ammo on them. I, it doesn't matter. Okay, so the reason I came here is because the stash down here... Oh, Jesus. I thought I saw something. Is it dead? No, no it's not. What the f... Okay, I'm just going down. Ugh. I hate those things. So the stash down here, I already looted it, but apparently, if you loot it after you do the UAC thing, a weapon will actually appear in here, apparently. That's weird. Um.
Was there a weapon in here before? I don't... I don't remember what was in here before exactly. Maybe I already got it and I just wasted my time and I just totally forgot what I did. Huh. Um. Okay then. Time to go to the next stash. Huh. On the way to this stash... I decided to check out this little channel here, and found another stash. What's in here? That's it. Most of this is so bra ba so bad, I don't even want to take it. It's like an insult, but I do want to clear the stash. So, I'll take it. Sounds like a storm's brewing. That does allow me to... Demonst well, I shouldn't say demonstrate. Test something, actually. It says, I haven't actually done it myself yet. So someone was telling me about uh, a cheaper way to eat than normal. Get out of there. Oh my god, when did I pick up all these pistols? Must have been when I was looting the zombies. I accidentally took them. Ew. Get out of here. Okay. So yes, there should be a cheaper way to eat. So one thing about being a sniper, as it says in my little card here, uh, towards the bottom, it says unhealth, uh, immune system resistance, unhealthy food, A+. So apparently snipers are actually extremely resistant to unhealthy food, of which uh, the meat from mutants is, of course, very unhealthy. Now where's the grilled one? The one I just picked up. Is this? Is it this? No. Which one was it? Fur, fur, what the hell? Oh, here it is. Yeah, boar beef. So this has been cooked. Grilled and seasoned with salt and mixed with peppers. Mmm. So you can see it actually gives you a lot of food, about equivalent to one of those little energy bars. But it also gives you a ton of radiation. However, I'm very resistant to it. Plus, if you combine it with these Akvatabs, which I have quite a lot of, which will actually take down your radiation, and also they give you a bit more food. See, 200 calories. Means you can actually eat for pretty damn cheap if you combine the two. So I'm, I'm going to try that. Let's try eating this. Which, of course, is going to give me a lot of radiation. Mmm. And let's take an Aquatab. And I should be good. It's going to take a while for the radiation to go away. Probably 10 seconds. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay. Never mind. Even faster than that. So, yeah, you could absolutely stuff your face with probably even raw meat and then just take an act for tap and you're fine. I mean, like a normal piece of meat might give you, I don't know, like 400, 500 milla. What is that? Is it millisieverts or something like that? The radiation? So, it's something of the sort. And an Akvatab will take away about 30 per second for 34 seconds, so 34 times 30, whatever the hell that is, it's a lot, way more than a piece of meat. So yeah, combine it with Akvatabs and you're good to go. You might even be able to combine it with something like a couple swigs of water. Or, or vodka. Yeah. Ah, now I've got so much stamina. I'm pretty much at the stash. I do wonder if there's more stashes here, though, in this canal. Always gotta check the pipes. Could be a backpack in the reeds. Actually, probably wouldn't be in the reeds, because then it'd be in the water. Hmm. Anyway. Okay. So, I was looking for this stash. First thing I did, of course, was look above ground, and there's absolutely nothing there where it's marked. Let's go back there. Okay, I think it was right at this tree, right? Pretty much, yeah. So, obviously, it's not here. So, next thing I did was look in the sewers. A little underground place, but I couldn't find any place where the sewers actually went to here. 
they came close, but they never actually went here. So someone gave me a hint, and the hint was basically ruined bridge. And that's it. So, there is a ruined bridge over here, of course. So maybe there's a way. Maybe there's like a little tunnel down here. And so there is. Ooh, this looks like it's... Oh, yeah. Got anomalies all up in here. Oh, can't even see my damn readout. Alright, light it is. No night vision. Okay, so it's gonna be right in that corner. Or maybe further in. What if there's any other stashes here? Hold on. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Hello. What the hell? Wait, what? Something's wrong. It's marked on my map as a stash. And it says it's unlooted, and yet there's nothing in it. And there's also nothing in the loot back at the Jupiter plant, when I'm pretty sure there should have been. Now, I did ditch my note from Strelok in my storage compartment, but, like, why would you have to have it on? I'm, I'm thinking, do you have to have it on you for the loot to show up? But why? That wouldn't make any sense. Well, that's disappointing. Huh. Okay. Right. Well, I'll be right back. It's time to enter the land of a million beasts. It's time to try to get this stash, which probably isn't even worth a damn, but I don't care. I want it. I'm entering the blurry part of the map, which is blurry for... I... I don't know why. It would suggest it's outside of the map, sort of, like on the boundary, but... I'm pretty sure this is one of the spawn points. Isn't this, isn't this where I spawned? Like, right here? As a sniper? Kind of weird that it's blurry. But anyway, yeah, there's a lot of things here. A bunch of fleshes, a bunch... Oh, and a bunch of snorks. Uh, that's gonna be a problem. Shit. Didn't have a grenade loaded. Okay. Excellent. Yeah, look at all of these freaking things. Flesh, flesh. Boar. Fl uh, another boar. Flesh, flesh. I saw a bunch of cats around here, too. I think they... Guys over there shot him. That's another boar. Yeah, there was even more here before. Oh, is that another snork? Oh, crap. Yeah, it was another snork. Mm, not sure if I can hit it from this distance, given how fast they move. Nah, that's too slow. Too far behind. Nah. I should be able to deal, to deal with just one. Hey, Fleshy. Come here. Come here. Come here. What are you doing? Come here. Alright. I just want to pet them. They're so cute. Is that a boar? Yes. That is a lot of boars. It's gonna be a major ammo sink if I have to actually kill them. Hey buddy, how you doing? Oh my god. Okay. Oh, should be right about... Here. 
It's all a lie. No, it's probably in a bush, like, right next to it, right? Oh, what the... What did I just pick up? Whoa. Okay. That's a pseudo-giant and a snorg. It's time to leave. Okay, what did I pick up? What the hell did I pick up? Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down. Calm. Bad flesh. Bad flesh. Why would you do that? I'm your friend. Okay, what in the hell did I pick up? Oh, I forgot to loot the bodies, too. I'm still in the mode of not looting them just in case it crashes. I... Was it a stim pack? Uh... I don't know. I mean, if I can't even figure out what it was, I guess it wasn't too important, was it? Okay. Well, I... Whoa. Uh, you might not want to walk out into the middle of the water in a swamp, surrounded on all sides, literally all sides, by beasts. Not the greatest of ideas. Yes, my fleshes advance. Or don't. They're in formation at least. There you go. Get him, get him, get him. Okay, the fleshes are incompetent. Whoa, calm down. Oh, they're not looking at me. Right. Well, I'm gonna cut here and I'll be right back when I go to do my last thing, I think, before I start on the road to Pripyat. Okay, here's one of the other things I was trying to do. I am getting the other pair of calibration tools. They're at the sawmill. They're, well, right here. Boom. I'm gonna go give those to, what the hell is his name? Corden, Carden, yeah, Carden. Let's go give him the tools. Let's go ahead and give him the tools. Here you go, my friend. Now just some tools for basic work, and I'm good. Okay, so I think if you get all the tools, every single one you can get, you get an achievement. So the only thing I'm missing are the basic tools. I don't remember where they are, though. I know I got my basic tools for Nitro, um, from here, I think. AA Complex. I don't remember where they are for here. I think I got my fine tools from the Iron Forest, so they probably wouldn't be there. They'd be somewhere else, most likely. Hmm. Ranger Station? Maybe? I kind of want them. Just for the achievement, if nothing else. I'm gonna find them. Okay, well, I finally found the basic tools, and they are indeed at the ranger station. I searched this place really thoroughly, as you can see. Found a bunch of stashes. And it took a really long time. I had to fight like about a million bandits and or... duty? I'm not quite sure what they are. Some of them seem like duty more than bandits. Not really sure. But yes, I had to fight a lot of them. So much of them that I have all of this loot. Oh my god, I have a lot of loot. I took epinephrine. Just so I can carry it all efficiently. But anyway, here's the tools. Tools for basic work atop the pipes. Right in this little room here. Also, I hear voices, which are probably more assholes. So let's go shoot some assholes in the asshole. Actually, I'll probably shoot him in the head. Seriously, I mean, I, I shot, like, everyone here, and then I was looting, and then another group showed up, and then I killed them, and then another group showed up, and then I killed them. Like, they're just trickling in. Let me guess. You're... Are you... Are you an asshole? 
Are you an asshole? Hmm? 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 I'm... Is he scared of me or is he getting cover? Hello? 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 I've got a surprise for him if he's evil. Hello? Where did you go? Oh, there you are. Oh no, he's just going from body to body. He's super excited. Okay. Uh, what are you? Duty? Freedom? Well, you can't be duty because you tried to shoot me. I guess you're freedom? <laughs> His last name is Turd. Zenka Turd. Ah, you're freedom. Oh wow, look at that loot. All came off the bodies. Hm. Ooh, a guitar. I like the halo behind your head. Look at that. Whoa, it's glitching out. Oh god. Okay, time to go give the tools to Corden, Carden. I can never remember his name. One day, I'll remember it. Maybe. Mm, probably not. Alright, here's your tools, Corden, Carden. Carden, that's your name. Alright, bro, I brought you some tools, man. Well, the ones for basic customization, I guess. Yeah. Awesome, way to go. What's your secret, man? Watch me make a, a machine gun out of lighters. Good luck with that. Yes, weapon systems master achievement. Let's look at that achievement. I worked hard for that achievement. Uh, stats. That's it, yeah. Now Carden has all the tools he'll ever need. Those allow him to perform new and more complex upgrades. Well, no shit. He can't do anything special, though, compared to Nitro, right? I mean, Nitro has the full set, too. Let's find out. I... Yeah, he can't do anything special. Nope. However, I think that getting that achievement might allow you to buy an exoskeleton suit, someone said. Um, who is it from? Was it from... Привет, товар какой this dude? Let's see. There's three different suits here. Closed respiratory module, obviously that would not be the exoskeleton suit. The ghillie suit obviously is not it. Armor suit of high quality. Mmm, I don't think that's it. Who did you get it from? Can you just buy it from... Anyone? Do you have it? No. I forgot who you bought it from. I mean, I can't even afford it right now anyway. And I don't even think I'd want it, even if I could. Because you'd probably want extra money to upgrade it. Yeah, you don't have it. No, I'm pretty sure if you have an unmodified exoskeleton suit, you can't run in it. Like, that's some severe limitations, so you definitely would want to upgrade it before you actually really use it, I think. Hmm. Well, anyway. Close that. Now, I want to mess around with some weapons. So I'm going to try some out. I'll be right back. Okay, well, my tying up of loose ends and stashes and whatnot has come to an end. I did get a weapon from... What the hell's his name? Nimble? And it's this. Frasier. Good old Frasier. Yeah, someone was telling me about uh, how it's good to have the MP5 from Nimble. Because it puts out a lot of rounds, it can do a lot of damage really quick, and that is very much true. I haven't used it against enemies yet, but I can already tell, this thing is going to decimate them. My class proficiency is low in it, but I don't even think it matters. It doesn't really need to be particularly accurate. The best thing about it is that it uses 45 rounds, or .45, and its fire rate is insane. Just look at its fire rate, compared to this. It's like double the fire rate. And I'm using the Hydroshock rounds, which 
Tissue damage rating, very high. So, I wanted this weapon just to have another weapon in my arsenal, just to kind of test it out and have fun with it. But it does also serve a practical purpose, and that is taking care of... Let's see, what? I guess... Well, I could use it against any mutant that would come across me. You know, come at me. But especially chimeras. This thing will wreck them. It put out it puts out so many rounds. Just look at this. Yeah. It is going to kick their ass. I'm just looking at the bottom right. Why does it say 430? When I have the MP5 out. That's the number of rounds of standard shots I have for my other weapon. I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't matter. But yeah, this thing should be fun to play around with. Okay. And by the way, everything I just did, all the finding of stashes and all that stuff, took about 2 hours and 40 minutes. And I'm gonna be edited down to, what, probably less than a half hour? Damn, that took a long time. Alright. Now it's time to try to actually go to Pripyat. And I think I'm good to go. I mean, I've got tons of food. I didn't mention this, but I actually baked up a bunch of mutant meat. And I'm just gonna combine them combine them with my Akva tabs. And it should take care of all of my hunger needs. I mean, look at this bloodsucker goulash. Ugh. It uh, gives me 600 calories, which is a shit ton. Got some wonderful bacon. Mmm, boar beef. It's actually pretty heavy stuff. Which is why I'm pretty weighed down at the moment. But yeah, I fully upgraded this thing. I've got lots of food. I've got tons of batteries. Five, I've got tons of repair for my weapon. Tons of repair for my suit. I've got a crap load of rounds for my main weapon. 430 standard, 234 armor piercing. Uh, a decent amount for this gun. My Frasier. Which, for some reason, Nimble called it Cutter, but it's actually called Frasier. I don't know why. But anyway. I, like, I'm good to go right now. I feel like there's something I was going to do, though. What, what the hell was I going to do? What am I missing? Oh, yes. Um, epinephrine. Actually, I want to buy some epinephrine. You probably won't have it. No, that'd be on the dock. Wrong way. Wait, that's nitro. Dock is this way. Do you have epinephrine, my friend? I don't think I've ever bought it before. That's cocaine. I don't want cocaine. It'd work, but I don't want it. Is that it? No. Shit, maybe it doesn't sell it. There's so many items, I might just be missing it. Eh, whatever, I'll be fine. Счастливо, не болей. Yeah, I wish I didn't have so much weight on me. I'm also carrying all of my documents. Just in case I need them in Pripyat. I don't really know what the hell's gonna go down in Pripyat, but anyway, let's go. I don't even think I'm actually leaving right now for Pripyat. This is just the... Try to figure out how to go to Pripyat. Sort of part of the quest. Not much. Sure, let's drink. Am I drinking? I'm assuming I'm drinking right now. But nothing's actually happening. There we go. Nothing like discussing business while none of us are 
have our brain faculties uh, good enough to actually understand what the hell's happening. Eh, yeah, going in. Yep. Yeah, uh -huh. Okay. Let's have another drink. Sure. I'm pretty sure he's pouring the drink all over his neck before he even gets it to his mouth. I can do it on my own, you know. Maybe I can, but I don't really want to. So, Nitro advised me to get a squad together. Yay. Why are your feet so big? Ooh, a lot of options. We need at least three people. You got anyone in mind? Huh. You know this weird fella called Noah? I do not want Noah on the mission. Hmm. Vano, Vano, I you pronounce his name, Adyanov. Hmm, there's a military guy and a scientist spunker. You know what? I think the Monolith Squad sounds pretty good. Are we gonna drink again? Oh god. I don't know, if anyone would know how to survive there, it'd be the Monolith Squad. Oh. I guess he meant... no. Alright, fine. I, I guess I need to take these people. We need at least three people, and there's three people here, so... yeah, alright. Uh-huh. Sure. God, do I have to drink every single time I'm gonna have someone come? Right, so I guess this mission can only be completed once you've done a lot of other stuff, to the point where you can have three people come with you. Mm-hmm. God, I wanted the Monolith Squad, though. They'd be badass. I remember fighting the Monolith in... What the hell was it? Was it the original Shadows of Chernobyl, or was it Clear Sky, or maybe both? I don't remember. Drinking to Noah, the crazy bastard who's tried to shoot me in the face with a shotgun probably five times at this point. We need at least three people. We already have three people. Okay. Okay. Okay, need closed respiratory suits, of course. Do I have to buy them for them? God, I hope I don't. I don't think I have the money. I just spent it all on upgrades. Okay. Ah, <sighs> oh, relax, man. I found the Oasis the other day. That same one nobody else could get to. Yeah, let's not boast. Let's just mention the plan. I've got schematics. Alright, I'm pretty sure at this point I have alcohol poisoning. <sighs> Am I passing out? Yep, I think I just passed out. Значит, уговор. Идем вместе. Найдешь бойцов, присылай ко мне, буду делать из них команду. Когда все будет на мази, дашь знать. Забираем азота и вперед на Юпитер. Once everything is ready, give me a shout. Okay, so what do I need to do to get ready? I mean, I'm ready. Obviously. So, what's up? Okay. You already have Zulu, and he has suggested that you send new recruits to him. Don't I have enough people? I didn't actually read the text. Maybe he was saying no to some of the other people, too. I don't know. Okay, he needs protection. Do I need to give it to him? I, I guess I should just go speak to him. Okay. Do I just need to speak to the people that I need to come with me directly? 
the guys who stayed at Zaton will go to Pripyat for sure, alright, so don't bother going back there. Alright, oh my god, that is beautiful. Whoa, look at that. Oh yeah, this calls for a demo record. Shit. No. Yes, there we go. Okay, alt. No, alt fast. Shift is slow. There we go. Look at that. Oh, clipping. Doesn't look good. Beautiful. I kind of want to go out the window. Can I go out the window? Mm. Sweet. Ooh, I'm hungry. Oh, that's why my stamina is so terrible. Alright, it's time to eat this bloodsucker goulash. Mmm. Got a bit of radiation inside of me now. Rat skewers. Oh, that is not much. I'll have it. Yum. Like 70 calories, that's like nothing. Pills and radiated meat. Mmm. There we go, much better stamina. Okay, so what the hell do I need to do? Hello, do you want to come? Yeah, do you want to join me? Oh, cool. My suit has one. You can stick your head into an oven and breathe just fine, but I pawned it out of Hawaiians. If we can get it back, I'm broken. We'll need 24,000. Oh my god, I don't think I should have spent my money on upgrades. Fuck. Okay, here. Oh my god. This is the guy I helped out and we're like friends and he's coming along with me and my dialogue option is... Here, take your fucking money. Let's go see that fat pot pipe Zulu. Wait, fat pot pipe? What the fuck? С чем пожаловал? Слушаю тебя. Okay. Great, we've got ourselves someone to carry all our supplies. He's the pack mule. I think we've got enough people we can move out. No, we do not. How long have you known him? We met at 100 rads a couple of times. 100 rads? What the hell is that? Is that a bar from one of the older games, or...? It sounds vaguely familiar. Alright, need more people. Yeah, I might need to sell some of my stuff. Which is okay. I got a bunch of stuff, and a lot of it I don't need. A lot of big repair kits, and like my old sniper. Что скажешь, брат? <laughs> Can you leave me to Pripyat? Ah, he doesn't want to come. Hey, what if the old guy wants to come? You, you want to come? Will you go to Pripyat with me? Ah, no. He's too old. Fair enough. Oh, I can ask the uh, Freedom to join us. Oh, sweet. Talk to Strider about a protective suit. Who the hell is Strider? Is that the main guy? Take Strider to see Zulu. Oh, I kept my monolith armor and it comes with exactly that. Okay. Fair enough. С чем пожаловал? Слушаю тебя.
It was part of a set. Wait, what? Oh, monolith armor. Where the hell did you get that? <laughs> it was part of a set. Mm hmm. What do you think about Strider? Mm, they're usually fanatical. Yes, I remember that. Okay. What time is it? 9 a.m. It just looked dark because it's all foggy. And rainy. So I need we need at least three people. I suppose it wouldn't hurt to have more. If you even can have more. You probably can. What if you like fail the mission if they die? I don't want to have to babysit them. Hmm, what about Trapper? Nope. Alright, let me finish going over on this side. So talk to him, talk to that guy out there. What about you? I have documents from the Jupiter plant. Oh. I do have all the documents on me. Should I give them to him? Does it matter? Uh... I guess I could. Hold on, let me save and see what happens. Hmm. Sell them to him. I... Should I? Should I not? I'm gonna keep him. For now. Can you give me a squad, please? Talk to Strider? Alright, already done. I don't suppose the medic wants to come. Oh, I can actually ask him. There ain't that many crazy folk around here, buddy, so you'll have to look elsewhere. Fair enough. What's that over? Dorba! Go to Pripyat with me. Fine, don't, well, asshole. Come to Pripyat with me. Fine, fuck you too. Привет, Come to Pripyat with me. <sighs> Come to Pripyat with... Oh no, I don't even know you. I think Nitro wants to come, right? Who the hell are you? Cabbage. Hello, Cabbage. I'm surprised you're not shooting me. Bouncy. Nitro. Hmm. Shit. Oh yeah, the third guy. Alright. So I'm not sure about four people, but I can definitely get three. The fourth guy is at the scientist's bunker. Stamina is not great with all this weight. I think a lot of the weight comes from the the ammo, because I've just got so much of it. Yeah, I did ditch one of my uh, was it titanium frames or whatever they're called grid for another plate. Ooh, I should see if I can buy some epinephrine, too. Epinephrine, epinephrine, epinephrine. Who's that? That is epinephrine. Oh, it's only 3,000. I kind of want to buy them all. Eh, fuck it, I'm going to buy them all. 10,000, whatever. Wait, is there anything else to say to you? 
I found some documents of the Jupiter plant. Oh, don't even care. Hello. Sweet. Okay. Talk to Ozerski, Ozersky about a suit for Solicycle, whatever they have, whatever. Hello. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What do I need to do? An area filled with a previously unknown anomalous plant has appeared near the edge of a quarry. Okay, so I need to get him a plant. I will find this plant for you. Get a plant sample. I can do that. I can get flowers for you, my friend. Okay. Ah, so you do actually do something at the Anomalous Grove. An anomalous plant in an anomalous grove. How appropriate. And I'm gonna reappropriate it. Is that even a word? Reappropriation? I think it is. Doesn't that mean basically stealing? Kind of. At least in this con. I don't know. I'm just confusing myself now. Like, I don't want to just take epinephrine constantly, but that'd be an incredible waste for such a short distance. It seems too simple. Walk a short distance, get a plant, come back, and I'm done. Like, there's gotta be more to it, right? Like, pseudo-giants are gonna rain down from the sky? Like droplets of water? Alright, so where's this damn plant? Is it right in the center? Pretty much. What's my toxicity resistance? It's pretty good. I could take toxicity medicine, but I don't think I need to. Oh, there it is. Whoa. Whoa. There's more anomalies than there were before when I came in here. What the fuck? How's my suit doing? Not great. Okay, Jesus, what the hell happened? It's like they closed around me. It's like they're protecting their plant. Holy shit, that is a heavy plant. 3.67 kilograms. A plant that was part of a grove which was partially transformed by anomalous activity. The grove reacted to the intrusion with aggression, but the plant does not appear to be dangerous so far. must have gotten, like, the roots and everything, right? Because the actual stock part of it, if that was... I mean, I saw how big it was. It was... It was tiny. It was like a couple inches tall or something. For that to weigh that much is pretty insane. Even the roots, though. Unless it's got roots like a tree or something. It is an anomalous plant, so I suppose the weight is... Also anomalous. Freedom! Mm-hmm. 
Okay, I'll hand over the suit. Tell Sokolov to come and collect it. Okay. Ooh. Da -da, Pioneer. Yes, you. Achievement. What is that? You're willing to research the most recent developments in the zone? You have advanced our understanding of the zone by finding new anomalous formations previously unknown to science. No? Yeah. Okay. Oh, another achievement. Sokolov, the co-pilot of the military chopper that crashed. Well, I think we've got enough people. Good. Let's roll, folks. Where are we going to appear? Are we going to, like, pop up in Pripyat? Or... No, there's no way. That'd be too easy. We're going to the Jupiter planet, right? Yeah. Ugh, твою мать. Okay, so we're going to open that huge... blast door... Thing. What the? Нечего мне тут. We're actually going to Pripyat, aren't we? I'm actually going to Pripyat. Oh my. Oh my. Ну что, дорогой? Пошли. It's time to make a perma save. Okay. So what are we gonna face? Probably mutants. Rather than people, I would assume. Yeah, we are in Pripyat. Ну что, дорогой? Пошли. Yeah. Let's go. I just realized I don't have any artifact containers. Huh, that's fine. I guess at this point I don't particularly even care about getting artifacts. 